Hi, my name is Tracy Mainland. Most of you know me as Tracy Mainland Cramble or Cramble in the gym. I'm at a thousand workouts and I work out at Fit Club. I think the biggest change for me, um, obviously, is the physical aspect. I've lost a ton of weight and gained a lot of muscle since starting at Fit Club. Um, but the psychological changes was a big factor for me. Um, I've decided three years ago, or three and a half years ago, to commit to myself. And what that meant to me was making sacrifices at home, uh, making time commitments, getting up super early in the morning. 4.30 is unheard of in most lives. Um, but I think for me, the psychology of coming in, the commitment of coming in, um, um, the food choices that I've consist consistently changed in my world um, and really being cognizant of what I'm doing every single day and trying to add physical activity into my world. I'm an older mom. I am uh, today, this, this is 50 for me this year, this is 50. And I have two small kids, one in grade five and the other in grade eight. So I want to make sure that I'm around for them as they grow. I want to make sure that they're okay with an active mom. And I've committed that to myself to be there for them. I think the biggest struggle for completing my thousand workouts is myself. It's it's here, it's available, I need to make the commitment and I have to get in every day. So um, hitting the snooze button in the morning, deciding that today I'm going to sleep in instead of get to the gym, those were my struggles. And um, I think that the place is amazing, I love Fit Club. It is motivating to come in every day. So getting here isn't usually the problem. It's me making the commitment to come in is, is the struggle I have. Three biggest factors is yourself. Make the commitment. Commit to yourself. It's, it's such a big commitment and people say, oh yeah, yeah, I've got my kids. I've got too little time, too little this, too little that. Um, make the commitment to yourself. That would be the first thing I tell anybody. Um, the second thing I would tell everybody is um, really be cognizant of what you're doing every day. Um, when you're deciding to have that piece of cake or you're deciding to have that glass of wine, um, a couple of my personal weaknesses, really think about it, is it worth it? And yeah, you're gonna have those indulgences. Everybody has them, you have to live life too. But try and be cognizant on the days that you don't need to have them. And I think the third contributing factor to my success um, would absolutely be the people. And the people and the coaches, um, Coming in every day, having those accountability coaches, having those people that say, hey, where were you this morning? Um, the coaches are amazing. Um, you know, we've gone through a few coaches. Every organization does. They have all been spectacular. The coaches we have at Fit Club, Jen, Rick, RJ, they're all amazing and they motivate you to do better. They motivate you to try a little bit harder. They motivate you as well to Try something you haven't tried before. Um, doing a handstand push-up is something I had never done before. Here I am, doing five at a time. It's amazing. I'd really like to thank my girlfriend, Kathy. Um, she comes in usually in the early mornings with me. Sometimes we work out together, sometimes we don't. Um, but back in December of 2016, she signed up for one of these three-week challenges. She called me up and said, hey, we should try this. Maybe this will help us lose some weight. So we went into this place called The Dungeon and we were downstairs and uh, we had a blast. We were laughing so hard. Um, we referred to it as um, the floppy seal, which is actually known as a water bug. And we were on the ground. We both needed to lose a lot of weight and we couldn't touch our toes. We couldn't lift our legs up. Um, we had some big time struggles. And now both of us can do water bugs, no problem at all, side to side, doesn't matter which way, even dead bugs we have no problems with. We've learned all kinds of animal exercises since then. Um, so thank you. Uh, we have lost our weight. We are toned up. We are ready to go. And and I'd really, really, again, like to thank our coaches. Um, RJ, the facility you have here is amazing. Uh, I have to really give a really big shout out to everybody that worked so hard during COVID. Um, you know, we, we all come here multiple times a day. Some of us do doubles regularly. Um, we weren't able to do that. When COVID hit, um, our lives changed immensely. And RJ, Jen, Rick, um, all the other coaches that participated, you guys picked up the ball and you ran with it and you really gave us an outlet at home and uh, I have to give you credit because without you guys a lot of us would be in some really bad shape right now. So thank you so very much. Um, 
Throughout the three and a half years I've been here, um, I did lose my mom during that time and I really attribute the, the gym to getting me through that time in my life. I've had a couple of tragic things happen and I really attribute coming to the gym, getting that physical outlet, um, that psychology of everything that happens when you work out, the happy endorphins. Um, it works, the system works, everything works. Um, try it, don't ever hesitate, don't doubt yourself. Even if you're scared to walk in the door the first day, just do it and you will have huge success. What I'd like to tell my past self is what the hell are you waiting for? Get on the blue. My name's Tracy, I'm at a thousand workouts. I'll see you on the blue.